Now, the rest of the story. This is going to be an unconventional video. The reason I say that is because the video you're about to watch um, is about 25 minutes long originally. That got cut short down to somewhere around just under 10 minutes. Uh, the microphone you'll notice at the beginning of the video is kind of scratchy. Uh, I guess it was, well, from what ended up happening, is I didn't have the, the cord plugged entirely into the GoPro, so as we were driving, uh, it looks to me like it, it came out enough that it it came out of the camera so Brittany and I ended up talking for a good another 15 minutes or so without the camera actually recording any volume so this is a clip from later in the video um, I figure I would might as well make do with with what we got and I, I don't know um, it is what it is I'll try to I got some other videos I'm, I'm trying to get put up yet but I figure it was at least worth catching what little bit of this conversation we could. Granted, I think some of the more funnier parts are happening right about now, as you can tell. So, thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in. Take care. Take it easy. Keep in touch. I'll get that out of the way because you'll notice I ran the video out to when the audio just crackled out and then quit, and then it'll cut right to the end credits. So, you guys know that I'm not joking. It. It's not my fault. <laughs> all right, good bad news, folks. Well, it's all good news. Well, no, it's not. So let's get going. We are working on filling the last little bit of the bins. I know I posted a video about the bins are almost full. Well, it's been a while. And it took a little bit more corn than I thought. But after doing the math and running out that corn of mine, uh, I've come to the conclusion that it's actually yielding better than we thought. And my theory is, is because the last four years have been so terribly miserable. I'm not trying to sound like a big downer there, but oh, here comes the wife. Gotta go. Ah! Ah, I should probably see if she wants to ride along. Relina's in the house, my mom's watching her, so chances are Brittany's going to want to go back in the house. She's a good mom that way, though. So, here's a question. Is it Mountain Dew or is it orange juice? Because I still feel like crud. Today is... You coming? Uh, here she comes. Today is Halloween, for those of you keeping score. So, um, the best like we've ever had harvest wise in probably the past four or five years, we are, I'd say 90% done with harvest. You coming along? Do what? I don't know. Go pick my nose. Oh, sure. Just for that comment, I'm going another week without shaving. I think the... The ruffled lumberjack really looks good on me. Yeah. You gotta speak loudly because everybody likes hearing when, you know, I make fun of you. I have to sneeze. You did your makeup? Okay, you did your makeup to go to a haunted house? Seriously? I didn't want them to What's a guy got to do around here to get you to dress up for him a I little bit? I didn't want them to think I was Jeez. I have put up with you being all snot, snotty, nosed, and sick, and coughing, and gagging, and hacking, and oh no, just take Brittany to a Halloween house, and or haunted house, and hell oh, heck, I'll have to get my makeup done, done, and... Oh my gosh, all I did was put uh, eyelash stuff on. Oh, no, it's, it's good to know that you care about your husband. I do, I love you. Really, do you, I, do you know it's the sarcasm in that? You said that I love you. Okay, well maybe you got would have got a better I love you if you would have gave me more money. <sighs> For the record, no, I did not pay to marry her. I've been doing that ever since, but I did not pay to marry you. <laughs> so, um, as I was saying, uh, it is the end of October. Harvest went along rather quickly 
Um, where we were, were we gonna ever like really get done, like finish in October? Uh, that wasn't even a possibility. The reason I say that, it was a small possibility, I guess, but um, I have my grain sold for, and so does my brother, sold for November delivery. Now, because as of lately, it seems like the local elevators really want the grain. They don't want the soybeans, uh, but they want the corn. So, basis has really jumped up. It was, I locked mine in for 15, uh, eight, 18 under, it's 15 under for next year. Um, I locked mine in for 18 under, I just checked it. It is currently 30 under for November, and I don't know what it's gonna do after, with the election, and I know there's a lot of uncertainty in the market, so that's kinda working against it too. Um, if I wanna get Brittany to be quiet, all I gotta do is start talking markets and numbers, and she automatically shuts down. Why? I think my whole premise of this video just kind of got, you know, thrown out the window because I wasn't planning on you riding along. Oh, you should have totally heard me when I saw you pull in. I was actually, I don't know if you noticed that, but I actually kind of, you know, hit the throttle and started shifting gears. Oh, I was really? Is that gear. why you hit the brakes so I could come over? And and they know you. why I hit the brakes. You don't know why I hit the brakes because, you know, I, it's like I felt bad for it. Mm -hmm. I felt bad for it. I, don't need to I figured you'd run back in the house. Should we be feeling bad for my mom? She's watching her kid. No. Yeah, because Lena's Rena, Rena asleep. <laughs> so yeah, she's an easy baby. We are really lucky with her. Everybody seems to like her though. They, I don't know. Do you watch that video or know that I did a video? Her and I did a video here oh, really? a, while, a little while ago. And did she I was, say it was okay to put my child on YouTube? She wasn't on YouTube. She was just voicing her opinions oh. and the overview okay. oh, no. the okay. voiceover and I just gotta say she's a very strong opinionated girl like your mommy <laughs> so I don't know she's gonna be a good tractor driver someday we gotta get more cows around she can be a little cow girl actually that's gonna be her job feeding the cattle she needs a miniature pony she's not getting a miniature pony or a house pig or whatever else you think would be fun. No, I mean, she can have a miniature pony and come with the cows. No, because, I mean, guys back me up. If you get, like most of you that get a pony for your, your daughters, I mean, that's a more, oh, a pony for about a week. And then after that, it's just like, it yep, not. it's a four-legged dog. I got a pony. You got a horse that you didn't have to take care of or your parents, your grandpa did. So, but I still loved her. Oh yeah, yeah that's all it takes to take care of the horses. I love the horse, so the horse is just magically going to be fed and watered and sheltered. Hey, that's how it works with you. No, I pretty much take care of myself. When's the last time that I've actually been like fed at our place? I can't even remember the last time <laughs> that... I haven't had to fend for myself. Well, I have Not a, that I'm complaining, mind you. At I least have a baby to take burnt. care of. Say what? I have a baby, Relina, to take care of. That kid is so low maintenance. I mean, she passes out by 8 o'clock at night. <laughs> Problem is, so does mom. <laughs> so, oh well. Coal. Yeah, there's a big ditch. And... There's that bulldozing job, literally washed right down the drain. So we actually are working on the last of the down corn. Um, you guys, I'm pretty sure I should have uploaded the video by now, I think. Um, I harvested my down corn. Um, I don't know the exact number that it yielded because I haven't done the voiceover of my corn video, so there might be a little misunderstanding or you know, might be confusing you a little bit um, but the old monitor said it ran 133 bushels to the acre uh, the yield monitor is not calibrated right so it is a big fat liar uh, which makes me feel a lot better I would rather have the yield monitor be below rather than be reading too high I mean it would have really been unfortunate to say it was running well over 200 bushels to the acre and then find out that it was running 80. So feeling pretty good there. As of right now, I'd say it was at least 30 bushels under. Um, 
the last load hasn't gone to the river yet it probably won't because the truck is broke down and it's saturday so the plans of us getting this it's stuff not a done truck, honey. It's a, semi. a semi is also known as a truck no, actually, no you're not getting a tractor one. trailer yeah but because we are farmers uh -huh. you get kind of confused when you say hey go get the tractor and then here you come rolling around in the fucking semi just go rake hey <laughs> it's not happening <laughs> hey you never tried it i've tried a lot of things and i don't think i ever want to try driving the hey, semi there's a kitten. kitty 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 good cat get all the field mice that are out here <coughs> Um, so even the stuff that um, looks like it's blown over, the reel is doing a pretty okay job with, and he doesn't even have that much on yet. Um, the reel is doing a pretty okay job with keeping us moving. Um, we haven't had to actually stop and clean off any corn from the corn head since we put the reel on, as long as we're running with the reel. But what we got is what you just saw me drive through and one other strip. 